This is video number two on puzzles on numbers. Let's solve question number one. The sum of a number and its reciprocal is one eighth of thirty four. What is the product of the number and its square root? So let the number be x, and we have been asked the product of the number and its square root. So the product of number and its square root. Now let's analyze what has been already given to us. So the sum of that number and its reciprocal, so x plus one by x, is equal to one eighth of thirty four. So one by eight of thirty four. We can solve this for x and get the value of x. On the left hand side, we can write x square plus one by x is equal to. We can reduce this. Two times four is eight, and two times seventeen is thirty four. So seventeen by four. We can write this as 4x square plus 4 is equal to 17x. Moving this 4 to the left and x to the right. 4x square minus 17x plus 4 is equal to 0. If you solve this quadratic equation using the formula, you get x as 1 by 4 and x as 4. Remember that a quadratic equation has got two roots. So one of the roots is one by four, and the other root is four. So let us solve this for x equals to one by four and x equals to four. So if x is equal to one by four, x root x is equal to one by four times under root of one by four, which is equal to one by four times one by two, which is one by eight. So one by eight is not in this list. Let us Solve this equation for x equals to four. We get x root x is equal to four times root four, which is four times two, which is eight. So our answer is option one. The next question: the product of two natural numbers is seventeen. Then the sum of the reciprocals of their squares is. So let us assume that. These two natural numbers are x and y, so the product of x and y is 17. So x y is equal to 17, which has been given to us. So this can be written as x times y is equal to 1 times 17, and we can say that x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 17. Now, what has been asked? The sum of the reciprocals of their squares. So the sum of Reciprocals of their squares. So one by x square plus one by y square. We have to find out. So this can be written as y square plus x square divided by x square y square, which is equal to y square plus x square div divided by x y whole square. So we know the value of x and y. We can say that this is equal to Y square is 17 square, so 17 square plus x square is 1 square divided by. We know the value of x y, which is 17. So we have 17 square on the denominator. So this is equal to 17 square is equal to 289. So divided by we have on the denominator 289, on the numerator 289 plus 1. So this is equal to 290 divided by 289 so we have the answer 290 by 289 what could be the answer of this question so let the number be x and y so the sum of these two numbers is 22 so x plus y is equal to 22 and it is given that 5 times one number is equal to 6 times the other so 5x is equal to 6y. So let's put x is equal to 6y by 5 in this equation. So we get this as 6y by 5 plus y is equal to 22. So this is 6y plus 5y equals to 22 times 5. This 5 goes here. So 6y plus 5y is 11y. Is equal to 22 times 5. Therefore, y is equal to 22 times 5 by 11, and 22 divided by 11 is 2. So 5 twos are 
So we have the value of y. Now we need to find out the value of x. So we know that x is equal to 6y by 5. So x is equal to 6 times 10 by 5. And 5 twos are 10. So 6 twos are 12. So the value of x is 12 and the value of y is 10. So the greater one is 12. The sum of two numbers is 40 and the difference is 4. What is the ratio of these numbers? So we have been asked x by y if the numbers are x and y. And what has been given is the sum of two numbers and their difference. So x plus y is equal to 40 and x minus y is equal to 4. Now you have two equations. You can add these equations and you get rid of y so you can find out the value of x. If we add these, so x plus x is 2x plus y minus y gets cancelled out is equal to 40 plus 4 is 44. So x is equal to 44 by 2 is 22. So we have the value of x. Now find out the value of y. Let us put x into this equation number 2. We get 22 minus y is equal to 4. And therefore y is equal to 22 minus 4 which is equal to 18. So x is 22, y is 18. Now we have been asked x by y which is equal to 22 by 18. So we can reduce this 2 times 11 is 22, 2 times 9 is 18. So we have 11 by 9 as the answer. Okay, let us solve the final question now. The sum of two numbers is 40 and their product is 375. What will be the sum of their reciprocals? So, we have been given the sum of two numbers which is x plus y is equal to 40 and their product is 375. So, x y is equal to 375 and what has been asked is the sum of their reciprocals. So, 1 by x plus 1 by y is what has been asked. So, let us solve this. This can be equal to y plus x by xy. Now, we know the sum of these numbers x plus y which is 40. That's what is here. So, y plus x is 40 divided by xy is 375. So 40 by 375. We can reduce this by dividing both the numerator and denominator by 5. So, 5 eighths are 40. 5 sevens are 35. What remains is 25. So, 5 5 is 25. So this is 8 by 75. So the answer is option 